Happy Sunday! What is that? Oh, it's just, just bad lighting. All right, honeys. So, how many people have I lost in the first 10 seconds of this video? Woo! Love me a Sunday. I just, I just love them. I love Sundays. Hi honeys, happy Sunday. I have just gotten back from my run, so I'm feeling good. For those of you that don't know, I run every day, and Sunday runs are the best because you go out in the morning, there's no cars on the road, you see all of the sweet people going to church with their families. Ah, oh, Sunday feels. Anyway, so I've just gotten back from my run, and I am going to brunch with my friend Amanda today, and we are going to a Cubano restaurant, and of course, there's not going to be anything there on the menu that is in line with my diet, and that's a billion percent fine, because the purpose of going to brunch with a friend, in my opinion, is not to eat the food, it's to be with the person. And the food is just secondary to that. It's just an activity to do together, but really you're there to spend time with one another. We're not going for the purpose like we're gonna sit there, eat the food, and not talk with one another. The whole purpose is to spend time with one another. And for that reason, I will find something that works for me on the menu. I actually called the restaurant and I used the restaurant call script that I give out in my program to all of my clients so that whenever they go to a restaurant, they can get a meal there and they're gonna make me a nice tropical fruit salad which I'm so excited about but your girl needs more than fruit salad to fuel her Sunday because Sundays are my day I'm thinking about doing a vlog where I take you guys through what I do on Sundays now because it's I love it I just love Sundays so much I clean my sheets I clean everything I clean out my computer it is just cleanliness but anyway, before we go to brunch, because I did just run too, like if I just go to brush and have brunch and have tropical fruit salad and then we hang out afterward, I'm gonna be dying. So I'm gonna have some oatmeal before we go. And I always get asked how I make my oatmeal and honeys. Like if I was a pro, I'm I'm just your average, just your average Jane here making my oats. So I'll show you guys how I make my oats. I guess there's very high demand for this. So very, very fancy. Quick oats from Stop and Shop. I am a quick oats girl. And yes, technically rolled oats are better than quick oats, but quick oats taste so much better in my opinion. And I want you to eat the food, the healthy food that you enjoy and that you're gonna eat for the rest of your life. So when it comes to something like quick oats, instant oats, rolled oats, whole oats, groats, steel cut oats eat whatever oats you like the best because the best oats for you to eat are the ones that you're going to actually eat and that you're going to eat for the rest of your life so i like quick oats and they're nice and quick which is the best part so what i do is i'll just fill up however much i um basically you just want to be able to measure with something and i'm just using this bowl because I can, I'll be able to see how many parts oats to how many parts water I have. So I'm just gonna fill up this bowl with oats and then put it into my other bowl. So this is the bowl that I'm actually eating out of, as you will see. And okay, so I've put one bowl full in there. So now what I'm gonna do is I'm gonna fill this up completely with water and I'm going to pour it into the bowl. And then I'm gonna fill it up again, but not all the way. I like my bowls thick, honey. I like my oats thick. I don't like runny oats, no. So I filled it up almost all the way. And I'm gonna pour it in there. All right, and then I'm gonna pop this baby into the microwave for tres minutos. That's three minutes, by the way. Huh, took Spanish in high school, so I think I know. Okay, so in those oats, I have got my Duh, cinnamon ready for me and it's a shame because there are no ripe bananas in my possession at this moment the grocery store only sells green bananas it's like they want us to be constipated so I don't have any ripe bananas on me at this moment but I did future Emmy a favor when your bananas are ripe and ready to go and you're not going to use them Cut them up and freeze them. Make sure that you peel them before you freeze them. Pro tip. Um, so, and, and cutting them as well just makes it easier. So I'm just gonna throw this frozen banana into my oatmeal and my cinnamon as well. And I'm gonna be honest with you guys, the frozen banana, it hits different 
not even different. But it, it gets the job done. So I'm gonna make myself up some oatmeal. And right now I'm just waiting for the microwave right now. I have not showered yet. I literally just went on my run. And I'm thinking about what I'm gonna wear. And I literally just wanna be warm. I might wear a snowsuit to brunch. It's freezing out. So that's the look that I'm gonna go for today. Something that I often get asked is, Emmy, how many cups of oats should I have? What is a serving of oats? How many oats do you have? That's a question that I can't answer for you because I have no idea, first of all, anything about your background, but also, and that's why you know when people, when I work with people, I only, it's application and I don't invite everybody to work with me in the program we get on a phone call because i really really have to make sure that i know your background that you and i are a great fit to work together and i can't just give out willy-nilly advice if i don't know anything about you so back to the oatmeal question we have to remember guys we can eat as many times per day as we want to we don't have to eat just three meals a day we don't have to eat five we could eat 10 small meals a day or we could eat two huge meals a day and so if somebody is eating three meals a day if one of their meals is just oatmeal then they're going to need a lot a bigger serving of oatmeal for somebody who is going to have oatmeal and then maybe in an hour or two they'll have another meal well then they can have a smaller serving there's no perfect amount of food to eat at a certain time because who's to say how long that food is how long that is supposed to last us in terms of fullness so the way to find how much you should eat is to run your own experiment what i want to do through my platform is empower you to take control of your health and make informed decisions on this channel i'm not here to tell you what to do i'm here to deliver information that makes you be able to make an informed decision um, what you should never do is just take some person's word as gospel what you should do is research all of these different things run experiments on yourself using the bits of knowledge that you get from each of these sources each of these trusted sources that are hopefully based on science and not just based on one person's experience and see what works for you this is something i talk about in my program as well is that we work as an in, as a team to empower you to find something that's going to work for you as an individual not find something that you're just going to stick to because that's what you are supposed to do you have to be empowered to make decisions that are going to fit your lifestyle and work for the rest of your life so that's my spiel about oats and it looks like this guy is nice and nice and ready to go you know everyone's I'll tell you something about Healthy Emmy. Healthy Emmy does not eat pretty food. That's why you guys, like, I never post the pictures of my food on Instagram or anything because, like, are you kidding me? <laughs> yeah, people are gonna love that. But you guys, like, my YouTube fam is the real deal. The Healthy Honeys, you are the real deal. Okay, so I'm gonna eat these oats and then I'm gonna shower and then I'm gonna dress myself in a snowsuit and then head to brunch. So I'll see you then. Cheers to you guys. Hey, who wouldn't want that? Peace, love oats. Love you all. All right, I'm all dressed and ready for brunch and my outfit is, I literally just want to be warm. So I'm wearing my winter hat. I have on this sweater. I actually got this sweater dress from Amazon of all places. This denim jacket is from an op shop in Australia. I'm Australia and then I just have on I have on leggings and boots the lighting is not great to show you but we have got to go to the grocery store before we hit up brunch because I don't know if you honeys know but sometimes the kabocha squash is fire and then other times it is like like when it's fire it's a deep orange and it's like dry and starchy and it's so good and then other times the kabocha squash is like wet and yellow and tasteless and it's rude, but where I went yesterday, the ones that I got were top notch. And when that happens, like when it's a good batch, I go back and I'm like, I need to get all of them. So I'm gonna do that right now, but I've got to hustle because I got to make it to brunch. All right, it's the moment of truth for if they have what I want. Yes, they do. Okay, the squash has to look a certain way. If it's too, like this one's really green, so this one probably is not gonna be good. Um, and then this one, see this one's a little bit more grayish. 
this is gonna be a good one. So yeah, let's get ourselves some of these bad boys. This lighting isn't good. I need the light to stop coming from here. There we go. I figured it out. Cracked your code, Cannon. We got the goods. The squash. By the way, guys, I like should not be telling this story right now because I should be on my way to brunch. I have two brothers. <laughs> Everybody thinks that I have one brother. Okay, and it's so understandable because Max is never on the vlog and he never will be because he hates being on camera. He has always hated taking photos and it's like so wild to me because I like, I think he could be a model. Not trying to be weird, like nothing incesty or anything like that, but he's a good looking kid and he's 32, so he's not really a kid. But I need to set the record straight while I talk about this, the fact that I have two brothers, not one. You guys know Lindsay, my brother's girlfriend, right? Okay, here's Lindsay, Lindsay, okay? Here's the brother that you always see, Ty. These two do not date, that? <laughs> No, 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 no. Lindsay and Ty do not date. Lindsay dates Max. Here's Max and Lindsay, but you will never see Max on the vlog. Lindsay's on the vlog, Ty's on the vlog, Ty and Lindsay, no. Let's go to brunch. So we went to this place called Marielle in Boston and I got this gorgeous fruit bowl of tropical fruits and I got mango, pineapple, dragon fruit, and rambutan, which I haven't had since Australia. So a very Australia day for me. You tell the world everything you want to tell the world. Hi everybody, this is a delicious meal. My name's Amanda. I have just finished up brunch with Amanda. I got some delicious fruits and rambutan. Haven't had that since Australia, so honey, I'm headed home and we're gonna do a try-on haul. All right, I'm back and I've just put some comfy clothes back on. <laughs> okay, I have just gotten some actor back <laughs> Some activewear from Silph Like Loli. Wow, that was tough to say. I wanted to wait to even, I haven't even touched these yet. These are fresh in the package because I want to give the most honest, like this is a real deal first impression. So, ooh, this is nice. Oh my God, this is so cute. Okay, oh, this is so nice. So this is a workout top and the material is so thick and it zippers up the back and this is like a nice legit zipper. This is not like some, this is not your average zipper. Oh my God, this is so cute. I am gonna try this on right now. I also got, okay, I got one pair of leggings and then I got some MC Hammer pants and then I got another like sports bra workout top type thing. Ooh, honey, okay. Okay, I've been wanting for so, so long leggings that have the pocket that you can put your phone in. And now I have them! What a time to be alive! All right, so I got these leggings and it looks like they're high-waisted and if something's not high-waisted, I was watching Love is Blind and the man, which like, by the way, guys, you've got to watch it. It's wild. These people get engaged and they've never seen one another. It's, it's insanity. I, I can't stop watching. Um, so I was watching it and the guy was like, I hate things that are high-waisted. Keep your opinions to yourself. Okay, so these are some high-waisted leggings. I'm going to try these on, but I'm very impressed with with the quality of this um, and everything and I believe I got a small in everything that I believe this is no I got an extra small okay so I got an extra small in these leggings I got I think I got a small in, to, in the top because I have the world's longest torso I was talking to somebody and they're like I'm like you I'm all legs and I was like I think you got the wrong person <laughs> like I have the world's longest torso and the world's shortest legs. My legs are teeny. Yeah, so I got a small in the top, an extra small in the leggings, and then I've got another top here, which if I wear any color, it's gonna be army green. So I got, ooh, this is fancy, honey. This is gonna be <laughs> interesting to try to get on. Okay, so, oh my gosh, can I handle how fancy this is? This is a sports bra that, okay, 
So it goes, yeah, I'm going to try this on for you guys so you'll be able to see. But once again, yeah, this is a small. This material is fire. I'm really impressed. Truly, I'm so impressed. It's so thick. Love it. And then I got some MC Hammer pants because, as you guys know, your girl spray tan. So I need these pants. Like, I'm wearing them right now. I'm wearing MC Hammer pants. And I always wear those when I go get a spray tan, so I need more of them. So... I got myself some more MC Hammer pants. All right, I am loving these leggings and they're super stretchy too. Okay, so here is the top. I love it. Oh my gosh, this is so cute. And look at that sun coming in. Okay, so this top is absolutely adorable. And like I said, I love that it zippers up the back. Like this is so legit. I'm loving the sun is like, hitting my face right now so hard but i am seriously like i feel like remember guys on the macbook there was the effect that it it was just like the the light was shining on your face that's what i feel like right now <laughs> okay so this is the white top that i showed you guys and then i'm wearing the leggings that have the pocket and they're super stretchy they're awesome like really great material i'm very very happy with this right now <laughs> Look at the light on my face. I'm ins I look insane. I like these a lot. Oh, they're so comfy. I feel like I could dance. I could sing. I could hike a mountain. No, I'm do not plan on hiking any mountains. Okay, let's put on the other guys. Oh my gosh, this top is so cool. This is the coolest thing ever. Guys, I feel like this, this is like a bathing suit. I wish this was a bathing suit, but it's a sports bra. Okay, so... Here is the sports bra. Oh my gosh, this is adorable. I literally love it. I honestly, I think I'm gonna wear this as a bathing suit. Like this is so cute. I am dying. Okay. And then these, like, I think I'm just gonna throw these over right now. Like, let's be honest here. I don't really take off these leggings. Oh, they fit so well. They fit perfectly. Heck yeah. Where are the pockets? I feel like I, I can dance. I can do whatever I want right now. Nobody can stop me. Okay. Hey, remember me? Sunday morning, Emmy. I'm filming the outro of this vlog now because there's something I want to do. Because I want to know who's still watching. If you made it to the end of this vlog, comment panda. Yep. Comment panda if you're here. I love you, honeys. And I'll see you in my next video. Woo!